You know, I saw this, uh, there's a, was it the Iowa Register? Had an op-ed saying that, li- that Donald Trump should drop out of the race. I'm sorry, if you sit down to write that op-ed, you should then, once you've finished that one, move on to why virtually every other candidate in the Republican race should drop out. And why John McCain, for appointing Sarah Palin, for picking her, for nearly making her the vice president of the United States, why he should resign immediately. He should drop out of political life for that. And Lindsey Graham for calling Donald Trump and begging to get a reference to go on Fox and Friends so he can say, whenever I hear, I'll whatever, get rid of it. He should drop out of the race and he should resign his position in the Senate. And Scott Walker for the other day saying, on day one, there's a real possibility I may have to engage in aggressive warlike action. He should drop out of the race. Jeb Bush calling for Americans to work more. He should drop out of the race. Ben Carson, for virtually everything he said over the past three years, he should drop out of the race. Rick Santorum, he shouldn't even be allowed to run in the first place. Mike Huckabee, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Rick Oops Perry, sorry, I want to eliminate three major uh, agencies of the U.S. government, but I can't even name them. Drop out of the race. There should be no candidates running in the Republican primary in 2016. None. They should all drop out. They should all drop out until that party gets serious about implementing policy. Until they get serious about governing. They have created their own monster. They have made their bed and now they got to lie in it and they're whining about it. They should all drop out of the race. Give me a break. Rick Perry's indicted for God's sakes. Jesus. And Donald Trump should drop out of the race. Give me a break. I double my endorsement of Donald Trump. (laughs) 